Good afternoon. My name is Martin Seifert. I'm the president of Newfern. We consider ourselves a, a failed telecom startup. We did a lot of optical fiber and fiber technology and uh, have been in business for about 12 years. I'd like to take a minute this afternoon and show you what we do. We make optical fibers. And this in my hand is a telecom fiber, 125 microns in a tangible bundle that you can see and feel and our customers look at. But not only do we make the telecom type of signal fibers, but we make very, very thin fibers such as this 40 micron diameter. It looks more like Barbie doll hair. But we also make thick fibers that are used in the, some of the world's most powerful lasers um, and sophisticated equipment such as that. We do a lot of work in the fibers in the making of gyroscope fiber coils. And you can see down here on the right hand side, these little, what look like gemstones in fact, are actually coils of fiber that are wound very, very precisely in such a way that, and you can see the whole series, some have hubs and some do not, in such a way that they are useful for gyroscopes and attitude um, analysis systems, or what they call IMUs. We also make components such as couplers, where multiple signals and pump legs are brought into, into larger lasers. And these, these are key and important pieces to some of the bigger lasers that we have. A far cry from the original, just the fibers that we built, we actually make lasers from those fibers. Or actually, or these are actually industrial lasers, complete. They're powered on one end, and they produce a laser pulse on the other end that is used to mark everything that you possibly can imagine. A typical example that most people are familiar with is the marking of keyboards for computers. We build these in, in sizes from 10 to about 50 watts in power and in multiple wavelengths. Supplementing those, we also build amplifiers. Amplifiers are similar to lasers, but they take a signal in. And these amplifiers are used in a myriad of scientific and industrial applications, such as atom trapping, ultra-cold experiments, and the like of that. This year, we're actually launching an augmentation of that series of fibers, and I'll take you across to this side. At Photonics West this year, we are bringing out an entire new line of lasers, the CW version, which work off the same platform as the Q-switch lasers. However, they are used in different applications, particularly micro-machining, micro-welding, and micro-cutting. These lasers benefit from the same platform. They just broaden the industrial exposure of this product line. As we pass through the small series of lasers, we also get up to the very, very big. This particular unit produces 50 watts of power and is used very specifically for the uh, world record-breaking ultra-cold experiments. Whatever power of laser we tend to build, it always is undersized and the next customer wants a bigger unit. When it comes to the very high power lasers, Newford takes a great deal of pride in being a, a significant provider to the U.S. Department of Defense with the very high uh, power, narrow line width lasers. These particular lasers are separate power heads from the power supplies and can produce more than a kilowatt of power at very narrow line widths, making them extremely unique and very, very valuable for a number of very special defense applications. Thank you for taking a quick tour with us today. We're excited to show what we have to offer and we'd love to follow up any questions you have please visit us at our website at www.newfern.com or give us a call. Thank you.